Okay, this is the Catching a Flower Square, and I just finished round three. And at the end of round three, it said to join in your first single crochet, which is what I did. And remember that the single crochets were done in the chain one space of the V stitches. And the V stitch has the double crochet, chain one, double crochet. Round four, I'm going to work behind the chain four loops. And you want to make sure that um, it might be helpful to sometimes look at the front of your work to make sure that you're working in those double crochets so you don't have any extra stitches or not enough that you're working in. Round four says to slip stitch in the next double crochet of the V-stitch in round two, and that is that one right there. So I'm just going to pull the chain four space and I'm going to well, slip stitch in there first and then I'm going to begin my corner which is a chain three double crochet chain one two double crochet and that's the begin corner in that double crochet right there then it says to work two double crochet in the next four double crochet of the V stitches in round two so you're going to skip the front post stitches you see and there's one two three, four. So you're going to work two in each of those. Okay, so you can see um, there's my corner right there, the, the beginning corner, and then there's one set of two, two, three, four. So that's two double crochet worked in the next four, and then you work a corner in the next double crochet of the V stitch. And like I said, remember we're skipping the front post stitch, and you see the starting of another V stitch. That one right there is where you're going to work your next corner and the top of that double crochet and the corner is two double crochet chain one two double crochet and then you just continue working uh, two double crochet in the next four so remember that's one two three four and then you're going to skip that front post stitch and work your corner in that next stitch and I will be back with the next round